What's up YouTube, it's San Chisel 23 coming at you with my latest review. And today is September 2nd, 2011, and we have uh, the phone posits that released today. So I did pick those up. Um, very uh, on the fence about them. I seen them about a month ago at another store, selling them for like 350. So I had them in my hands and I saw the colors and I liked them. I knew I wasn't gonna pay money early to get them. Um, I did not want to do a midnight release for them. I uh, actually worked last night and I got out of work at midnight, so it wasn't happening. And I didn't want to get up early to go to the stores and go get them. So I just happened to stumble across these, so I picked them up. Um, if I was able to get them, I was going to get them. If I wasn't, I wasn't. And I wasn't going to make a big deal about it and pay over retail to try to get them, as I never do. So I got the Airphone Posit Pro. And if you're checking out this video on my channel, Sanchezel23, go ahead and subscribe. And uh, if you haven't checked out Reviews on Deck 23, go ahead and click the link so you can go to that channel and check them out. Um, I'm doing reviews for both channels. So let's get into it. Um, Phone Posit Pro, the Pine colorway, really dark looking shoe. Um, the green is a little different here on the check, as you can see. It's like a Celtic green. Um, they have the same stripe going all the way up the top and on the back. Now the foam posit material, what's interesting about these, they remind me of um, the eggplants and I brought those out so I can show you guys. The green, pine green, the tint to it is kind of green and then it turns kind of purple if you look at it real quick. So it's very reminiscent of this shoe. Same thing where the color kind of fades, gets lighter and brighter and darker. Um, another good shoe to have in the collection for the foams. So um, I brought that out so I can show you guys the same type of idea that they did with the pines. Um, so a lot of pictures surfaced about this shoe and uh, a lot of people got hype around them. I like them because they're a dark color shoe, they're great for the winter. Um, but there's nothing other really special than them. Uh, they did sell out everywhere where I was at. I was actually able to get them today at like around 4 o'clock. They only had a couple of pairs left at a sneaker store called Jimmy Jazz. So, but foot lockers and stuff like that, foot actions were all sold out. Um, online was sold out, so it was Nike.com. So it's one of those shoes basically where I, I stumbled upon it and I was able to get it. It looked good. Um, really not a bad looking shoe at all. Um, I, Nike Air is green inside, which is kind of cool too. Um, so it's a really good looking shoe, good shoe to have to the collection. Now the deal with this shoe is basically if you didn't get it today, you're probably going to go ahead and if you wanted to get it, it's going to be about 270 to 320 around that price range. That's what people are going to try to charge. Um, I'm sure a lot of people bought two or three pairs. Um, when I got these, which are another one of my favorite shoes, um, I'm, I'm, I'm a fan of the pros. I like the pros. Um, I wore these today and I, for the first time. I haven't got a chance to wear them yet. When I went to get these, there were people lining up to buy, you know, five or six pair with their friends. You know, um, House of Hoops only limited uh, two to each customer and then they limited one as they were selling down. So, you know, a lot of people bought two at one time and it was for like the same guy. I know he was going to resell them. So if you wanted to get these, you might run into a problem. You might have to pay a little bit extra. Um, so, you know, I'd like to review the shoes a little bit early for you guys. I get most general releases about two to three weeks early, sometimes a week early. But when it comes to these things, phone posits, are, they're, they're general release. They release everywhere, Jimmy Jazz, Foot Locker, all my local sneaker stores. But they don't last as, as long as the general releases. And um, the sneaker stores never usually put them out early unless they're charging more. So I got these for retail, 190 plus tax, 206, and it, it's a nice shoe. Um, so let me know in the comments, guys, if you like the shoe. Um, let me know if you got it. Let me know how much you're willing to pay for it if you didn't get it today on the release date. If you didn't get it today, I don't think these will be in stores in a couple days, so you're going to have to actually probably pay more. That's the sad part about the sneaker game. So uh, let me know what you guys think about these. Let me know if you like my other channel reviews on uh, Deck 23, if you checked them out yet. If not, go ahead and click the link and go check them out again. This review will be up there. I'm going to show you what these guys look like on feet, so you can see how they look and see if you really like them. The colors are really not that bad. I mean, I, I really, you know, seeing pictures of them, I was like, eh, nothing special. But, you know, the way it kind of, the tint is, the tint is a little purple, even though it's dark green. But, um, nice shoe all around. Here's the box. The official color is actually pine green black. So there you go. All right, guys. So let's see what these look like on feet. And don't forget to click the link to check the other channel. And that review will be up there also. Um, I'm still looking for people to help me out with uh, videos to get on that channel. About 400 subscribers right now in about two and a half weeks. 
So we'll do probably a, uh, a giveaway coming up soon on that channel. So go check it out. Reviews on Deck 23. I can't say any more much about it. It's a great channel. I got a lot of people helping me out with it. So uh, let's see what these look like on feet. Okay, guys, here go to Pies on feet. Put on like a little bit lighter jean so you guys can see a little bit more of the darker color. On the camera, it's going to look dark. It's a dark shoe all around. The icy blue bottom. Very nice shoe. Yeah, so like I said, if you weren't able to get these today, you might have missed out on them. That's it.